The missing Mars robot Beagle 2 has been found on the surface of the red planet, apparently intact. High resolution images taken from orbit have identified its landing location, and it looks to be in one piece. The UK led probe tried to make a soft touch down on the dusty world on Christmas Day, 2003, using parachutes and airbags, but no radio contact was ever made with the probe. Many scientists assumed it had been destroyed in a high velocity impact. The new pictures, acquired by NASA's Mars Reconnaissance Orbiter, give the lie to that notion, and hint at what really happened to the European mission. Beagle's design incorporated a series of deployable petals, on which were mounted its solar panels. From the images, it seems that this system did not unfurl fully. Without full deployment, there is no way we could have communicated with it as the radio frequency antenna was under the solar panels, explained Professor Mark Sims, Beagle's mission manager from Leicester University. The failure cause is pure speculation, but it could have been, and probably was, down to sheer bad luck, a heavy bounce perhaps distorting the structure as clearances on solar panel deployment weren't big or a punctured and slowly leaking airbag not separating sufficiently from the lander, causing a hang-up in deployment, he told BBC News. The discovery of Beagle comes less than a year after the death of the probe's principal investigator, Colin Billiner. The Royal Society Scientific Institution announced an award in commemoration of Professor Pilliner on Friday. The Open University scientist was the driving force behind the project, and although his mission never got to explore Mars, he is credited with sparking a huge enthusiasm among the public for space research. His wife and fellow B.